Hi there, I'm hoping that you're doing okay. Sa kabila naman nangyayari ngayon because of the virus. Uh, welcome sa mga timbahay dyan. So, in this video, I'll be sharing my patch effects that I use for my Zoom G5N. Uh, kung paano ko nakuha itong uh, ambient swell effect. So, the first thing that I did is uh, I pulled out a good tone na sa tingin ko, of course, on my taste na maganda siyang pakinggan. So, with everything turned off, this is uh, my guitar. This is how my guitar sounds straight into the audio interface. Take note na hindi na ako naglagay ng um, um, simulator doon sa uh, Zoom G5N kasi I need every uh, lo allocation, every location doon sa sa unit no uh, it only allows 9 effects sa isang patch so kapag naglagay pa ako ng ng amp simulator makukonsume nyo yung maraming memory so uh, ganito na lang yung ginawa ko okay so with my guitar straight into the audio interface this is how it sounds very plain no Okay, the first effect is a compressor. So, ang pinili ko dito is yung uh, op compressor. Uh, with the compressor turned on. Nagiging ganito siya. Again, from here to this one. Okay, so for the compressor, ang drive ko ay 5, ang low ay 50, high ay 50, volume ay 60. Next effect is EP Stamp, uh, Gain is 30, Bass is 3, Treble is 5, and Volume is 40. So, with the Stamp turned on, ganito ang tunog. So, unti-unti lumalabas yung uh, tunog ng aking neck pickup. By the way, this neck pickup is... Uh, I upgraded the neck pickup of my guitar, obviously. So, this is a Tone Rider Vintage Modified. And uh, basta yung vintage ng series ng Tone Rider. Okay, so third effect that I use is a volume pedal. Kailangan ko to for the swell effect. Kasi, no? Uh, of course, that's the basic for swelling your sound or your uh, tone okay so of course volume pedal okay yun lang yung nagawa niya okay the next effect after this is a pitch shifter so with the pitch shifter turned on ganito yung tunog niya Okay, uh, shift is on the 12 setting, fine is 6, tone is 7, balance is 50. Okay, next effect is a reverse delay. So, nandito na tayo ngayon sa ano, no, setting nung uh, ambient. Okay, first is, yeah, reverse delay. So, on time ko is 1000. Feedback is 20, balance is 50, tail is off. I believe this is the default setting of the reverse delay. So with the delay, uh, reverse delay turned on, this is how it sounds. Wow. Alright. For now, let's just turn off uh, yung pitch shifter for a while lang. Okay. Um, kasi uh, yung pitch shifter, pagka naka-turn on siya, parang ang, ang tunog niya parang organ eh. Parang church organ. So later, I will explain. Next effect is uh, digital delay. Uh, the time is set on a dated 8. Feedback is 50. Mix 70, tail is off. So, again, ito yung 
sounds mula kanina and then with the del- that it, uh, digital delay turned on this is how it sounds so siguro para mas maintindihan nyo yung tunog no, let me uh, turn off the reverse delay so uh, by the way my tempo is 70 Okay, so ito yung digital delay. Dotted 8. Okay, next is another uh, delay. So, pangatlong delay na to. Uh, I use a tape echo. Ang time niya is nakaset sa quarter note. Feedback is 70, mix is 90, again tail is off. Okay, so with the tape echo turned on, this is how it sounds. Okay, so naka ano ko, no, delay stacking. Yung isa, uh, again, quarter note, yung tape echo. Yung isa is dotted 8, yung digital delay. Okay? Okay, so ganun. Next effect after this is a reverb. So I selected uh, the church setting. Uh, pre-decay is 90, decay is um, 70, mix is 80, tail is off. So with the church uh, reverb turned on, this is how it sounds. As you could notice, no, medyo uh, lumalapit na tayo dun sa ambient effect. Well, basically, nasa ambient na tayo. Okay. Uh, I added another reverb, which is hall. Pwedeng wala naman, pero gusto ko lang. For me, it's, it's better. Okay? So... I will turn on the whole effect. Uh, before that, of course, the setting for the whole effect is pre-decay, 60, decay is 30, mix is 80, tail is off. Okay, so with the whole effect turned on, this is how it sounds. Okay. Okay, so that's all for my... Uh, effects that I use. Pero, itong patch na to, parang dalawang klase yung ambient na ginagamit ko. Okay, first, with everything turned on, except uh, pitch shifter. Okay? So, patay yung pitch shifter. Everything turned on, patay yung pitch shifter, and my pickup is selected on the neck. So, better to for uh, swelling just like nung sa intro ko so ganito okay yung isa kong uh, ang setting na ginagawa is I will turn off the reverse delay and then, I will turn on the pitch shifter. Pero sa aking pickup setting, I will choose a bridge pickup. This Dimarzio, this is a Dimarzio Tone Zone S. Okay? Um, ito naman for ambient, para siyang uh, worship pads. Okay? So, ito yung isang layer na naririnig nyo. Sounds like this. So, be careful lang, no? Um, when you're using this effect, konting mali mo, nagre-repeat na. Kaya talagang dapat maingat ka sa mga napipindot mo. And also for this, I'm just uh, touching the strings very, very light. No, not too much kasi ano lang siya eh, for layerings lang siya. So, this is just a pad sound. Uh, itong mga ambient and ambient swell uh, effect na to for me it's um, best to play during prayer time or free worship no talagang yung uh, congregation even as worship uh, leaders uh, focused on praying no pwedeng bible reading that is why I don't uh, recommend 
to play so much melody, so much uh, too many instruments while praying. Yung mga ganitong ambient uh, swells and ambient sound, it's for me, it's, it's better. Okay? Uh, okay, going back. So, for the third setting na pwede nyong gawin dito, uh, I'm just gonna turn off the pitch shifter and turn off also the reverse delay. Uh, I will also turn off dotted 8. So, ang matitira lang is yung dalawang reverb, which is yung church and hall, and um, yung tape echo, which is uh, set on the quarter note delay. Also, uh, if I'm gonna use this setting, um, I will switch my pickup on the number 2 position. Yung, yung both itong neck at middle pickup. So, the sound would sounds uh, be like this. Or maybe, I think this is too much. Maybe I'm just gonna turn off one reverb, which is yung hall. So, pwede ko na siyang gawin. play lead line something like this alongside with those uh, ambient and ambient swells but of course I suggest if you want to play lead line something like this um, dapat spacious no so something like this mga ganito Alright, so that's it for now. I hope na nakatulong ako or nakapagbigay ako sa inyo ng insight. I hope yung patch na ginawa ko is helpful sa inyo. Ah, by the way, before I forget, no? Uh, for the output dun sa G5N kasi, meron itong uh, tatlong main knobs, no? Yung boost, uh, yung tone, at saka yung master level. So, ang setting ko, for the tone is, siguro ano to, uh, 1 o'clock. Yung boost naman, in between 1 and 2 o'clock. Okay, so for the master level, uh, 1 o'clock din siya. Okay? So, of course, uh, if you're using a different guitar, uh, you may wanna shape your tone, adjust na lang yung overall tone, or doon sa compressor, at saka doon sa EP stamp. Depends doon sa taste nyo. Okay, again, thank you so much for watching and I, I'm hoping na nakatulong itong patch ko sa inyo in one way or another. Um, I'll see you next time and keep safe. Uh, sa bahay na lang kayo, try nyo to. And have a good day. Bye! Don't forget to subscribe and ring that notification bell. Also like, comment, and share this video if you enjoyed it. And also, I have other videos that you might like. Check them out. Cheers!